All right, are we ready for this, gamers? This is gonna be freaking weird. Good day, peeps. My name is Scripps, and welcome to an indie horror game called Lasagna Boy. And now, okay, before you click off the video, don't let these visuals fool you. Yeah, I know you might be thinking this is probably the stupidest game that I've played yet, but I promise you that this game has deeper lore than probably any indie game I've ever played. Because in case you don't know, and I have to make this disclaimer to my viewers who know nothing nothing about this, this game is based off of an extremely niche yet extremely dedicated horror subreddit called I'm Sorry John. A subreddit purely dedicated to making horrible gore recreations of Garfield. And I, I mean, I've never seen dedication like it. There's been complete Game Boy-like themed animations made off of the story. And I don't know where this origin story comes from or where it even originates from. I don't think I even want to know, but this subreddit is like 300,000 people strong. So I feel like I have to. I have to explore more of this lore. What is this game? And before I get off on ranting too much because I've been reading interested up on this lore, then I think I should just get to it. I don't wanna- I wanna just get right into it. Oh my god. I cannot tell if that is doofy as hell or ter- Oh my god, okay, I am moving. Oh, I'm hidden. Oh, oh wait, this is straight up horror. What? What happened? Also, if you haven't, or if you probably know about the subreddit already if you're on the internet because it's so freaking weird. And it's one of those things that would go fame. Ah, why? I'm in the middle of something. But it's just one of those things that's so weird, it, you'll probably find it on the internet. Oh. Okay, keep an eye out. Is this John? Because this does not look like John, but if you have not, then I highly recommend looking up like, I'm sorry, John, Game Boy, animation. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 I'm just gonna wait for you to trot past. You're way faster than I am, so I'm not risking this. What happens if I lose all my lives? I am sorry, John. I can't let you do that. Oh, I don't like how I can actually hear the audio. Home sweet home. Oh wait, am I supposed to walk out there? Oh wait, what? Oh, so if I click wrong, he'll find me. Is that true? Oh, okay. Okay, this is actually kind of scary. I don't want I don't want to find out. I don't want to find out what happens if I open the drawer wrong. Oh my- oh, okay, that was- Jesus. That is quickly. But yeah, look up that horror animation. It's so well done. Like, it even looks better than this game. It's put- it's got even more effort put into it than this game. It's such cool and well done animation. And I don't know why this subreddit or this story, this cult hit, is what deserves this. Oh, come on! He's so hard to avoid because he just turns around in an instant. If he stopped for a while, then that would be much easier. But Garfield is not to be messed with. No, 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 Oh, okay, okay, so it's the same thing. It's the same thing. What happens if I click it wrong, though? Will he find me? I feel like that's what- Oh, fuck! Oh my god, that- That is so stupid. Like, I, I can't hear him go that far away. And he does not give me a lot of time. He is not a patient cat. Oh, I hate that. Go, Garfield. I believe in yes. Oh, 
Oh no. I'm gonna mess one of these up one day. Oh, I got a key. Great, am I going back down again or am I staying here in this nightmare hole of hell? Also, you can go buy the full version of this. But I just wanted to see what the game was like. Because I, I know that I've seen the animation, the animation's fantastic. But I've never played the game before, so I wanted to be a little hesitant um, and, you know, not waste all my money immediately. Why can I crouch, though? Got a key! Oh no! Oh no! Can I hide under the thing? I guess I have to look at my status for the first time. In like ever. I'm not risking this. I can't see him from there. And I'm not, I'm not gonna charge towards him. Okay, I can hide behind the piano. Who keeps the piano in the attic? I don't know, man! Stop! Why can't- What the fuck was that, man? Just standing there looking at that freaking- Oh my... It's been- I, I can tell it's been a while since I played some more. No, oh, no, no! I was so close! No, don't send me all the way- Hmm... Alright, I got one life left. I'm not restarting this. Come on, Garfield! If you even are Garfield, I don't know. You know, almost as an ending to this video, I just want to browse the... The I'm Sorry John subreddit with you guys. That would be kind of an interesting twist to this. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, why? Why can't you just head off to the other direction for like five minutes? I'm not doing this with you here. Does he know where I am, actually? And this is all just a ruse? Oh, life. Sweet embrace. Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me I have to open that. I got the bolt cutters, but... That means I have to go all the way downstairs. And that's a big no bueno for me. That's good, I got the bolt cutters. Just don't let me freaking fail this. I just want to get back to my... Does John have a wife? I don't know, I never read Garfield. Oh! Okay, okay. I overestimate him. Can you use it here? No, nope, it's the other path, isn't it? I bet it is. Yeah, I just need to be patient. Wait for him to get far away. Oh, I just made a run for it. Oh, am I good? Oh, the basement, why? How much of this am I gonna have to do? My hands are sweaty. Garfield, no! But yeah, that, okay, so basically the animation, in case you wanna know... Well, I guess you could go watch it for yourself, but... What fun would be in that? And also, I'm just talking to ease the tension. But it's basically like a Game Boy. It's it's not a game you can play, but it basically emulates what it would be like if it was like a Game Boy game. No Garfield, no. I don't remember what the dogs call. Yeah, they're called completely different things. In Denmark, at least. Oh, come on, man! Can't just patrol around like that. Or well, maybe that's exactly what you're gonna do. I don't know. Come on. Oh, I got the dynamite. 
Now it's just about making it back. It's always so risky. Because I'm still not quite sure. Yeah, okay, see, that would have killed me before. There we go, there we go, okay. Set the damn TNT. What? I, but I, I have the TNT. Who do I need to set the TNT? Oh, I, oh, okay, okay. So yeah, I'm supposed to, because I kind of thought that looked like a mark. So I'm supposed to place them there. And I, I know he's faster than me, I know that. But he's not that much faster. So I can sort of outrun him? Or I mean he won't catch up on... Unless I reach the end of the stage. Come on, thick field. There you go. I placed it. Now I just need one more. I actually think that's under the piano. I shouldn't talk. That's just the short and the thick of it. I do not need to talk. Nope. <laughs> oh no! Okay, so now I just need to get downstairs. And I'm good. Go, John! Go, Johnny! Go, go, go! Johnny, be good. And I'm good. Whew. Sorry if there's a lot of silence in this, but I kind of feel it adds to the tension. So, since it's like a... It's like a marksman shot, right? Do we need to wait for him to go under it? Oh! Oh! Access card! Where? Was there a door down here? It's like a key card. Yes, it is! Fuck, fuck. Yeah, go, go. Jesus, go! Oh, thank- oh, that's it? Thank you for playing the demo. Holy crap! Okay! 469? Oh. Oh, 469. Oh, because- okay, that was- I bet- because- oh, so it was probably just like a few days ago that the full game was released. I bet that was the full release date that they put there. Holy crap! Okay. Well, anyways, during this kind of outro, I guess I could put up a bunch of the horrible fan art or the horrible stuff that I could find on the subreddit. It's actually really cool. It's a really cool subreddit just because it's so interesting seeing so many people gather around like such a weird niche horror cult thing. I kind of said the same thing about Siren Head, but it seems to be way more in effect when it comes to this subreddit. But to talk about the actual game, that was pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, I mean of course it only based on one mechanic, but that was really, that was some good tension, there was no like real music to it, you just constantly focused because you did not want to get caught. Uh, I kind of found out a rhythm to it, and I don't know if it could have been better if he was maybe faster or something, uh, to make it a little more horror-like, I don't know, and that, then of course mix up the gameplay. Um, I don't even know if the, this guy mixed up the gameplay in the final version, so I don't know, you guys can tell me whether or not if you want me to play a full version of this. Uh, I'm just saying it might just be more of what we've already seen here, more of just me uh, running from Garfield in between pillars. But that was really good. I, I'm not I'm not gonna lie, that was really good for something stupid and for something simulating like a Game Boy game, uh, but just with creepy I'm sorry John Garfield visuals and inspirations. That, that was still that was still pretty just well made from an indie horror perspective. 
Uh, but anyways, yeah, if there was anything I would leave this video off with, it would be to... I, I recommend you highly to go check out the subreddit. It's very cool, especially if you're interested in, like, horror stuff and interested in what people can create just out of their own fantasy when they decide that something is creepy. Because that's what just what they did. I think it was some original artwork that was released. Uh, some guy, some rando guy, like, artist made some creepy, creepy pasta, Garfield stuff, and then a lot of people just gathered around it, kind of like the whole Slenderman phenomenon, and it's really interesting to see. But anyways, that's all I got for this one, baby. That's all I got for Lasagna Boy. So anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.